Hey YouTube and fellow fish keepers, I just received a package from a friend on the forum that I frequent, a frame advice, and I'm just going to do a quick unboxing video, and I will probably go ahead and splice in a couple more parts just so you guys can see um, how I set up the capsules, but I may save that for just an entirely new video. I have not decided on that yet. So again, if you're just if you're a child, use nice with parental supervision or supervision of an adult. There's nothing worse than getting cut. I do know this from experience, so though not necessarily by knife, but I do know it from experience. One time I was moving a fish bowl out of my room, aka my fish room, before it became my fish room, and the glass broke, cut my thumb. Not fun. So just be careful when you're handling nice and yeah, see? Kind of just almost sliced my thumb. Not fun. <laughs> So in this package, there's Indian almond leaves, I-A-L, there's micro worms, and there's white worms. This package was supposed to arrive yesterday, but did not, so I'm hoping everything is still alive. And it's not any fault of the cellos if it's not. So if you're watching this, just don't worry about it. Should be alright. So... And I also asked her to include some instructions on culturing a few different things. May have to block that out of the video. Um, this, yeah. If you haven't seen my Marimo Moss Ball opening, I try to open one of these. I, uh, oh yeah, this is a heat pack, okay. Still quite warm, nice. Yeah, I tried to open one of those in my other video. Kind of, yeah, don't know what I was thinking with that. Let's see what this is. Ah, these are the instructions, nice, thank you. Oh, all the instructions, I have no idea. I guess I'll have to open it to find out, won't I? Might be, hold up. Pretty sure these are the instructions on how to culture the white worms, micro worms, and asked her to include some instructions on how to culture the brine shrimp since I have some Artemia in my fish room. You may see me just kind of going out of screen for a little bit. I just want to make sure my tablet is still on so that I'm not like totally missing any part of this. So I want to give you guys the full experience, including me trying to figure out how to untie this knot. <laughs> Um, you know what? When in doubt, don't use C full, use a knife. <laughs> oh, I love watching the Mythbusters. Too bad they're going out. Too bad they're not going to be around anymore. I like big things too. Just not, you know. Yeah. Kind of in the city, so kind of can't do that. Oh, let's see. Yep, I'm pretty sure. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Sweet. Okay, yep. These are the instructions. Awesome. Thank you so very much. You should really help get my live food cultures off the ground as far as the brine shrimp go. Let's see what else is in here. Micro worms. Yum, yum, yum. Not for me though, of course. I would like all my lands. When I got my black worms, they look like, yeah, you see all these, you may just search on YouTube white worms, and there are people who actually have how to culture them and everything. And it looks exactly like that. It was like literally a cup of slithering black worms. It's kind of cool. Great insulation. 
white ones. Nice containers. Another thing, white ones. Nice. Of course, the Indian almond leaves. These are nice and not crushed. Very nice. And what are these? Mmm, nice. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Sample of Kins Premium Tropical Flakes. Didn't even ask for those. That's awesome. Thank you. And I think that's pretty much all that's in the box. It is. So what I'll do is I'll go ahead and sh shut off the, cam the camera for now. And I'll go ahead. Let me fill my face real quick. I'll go ahead and um, set all these cultures up and do a how-to video. I'll probably post that in a different thing. But thank you for watching. Signing out now.